Chiba University is located one hour drive to the east of Tokyo in Chiba Prefecture with a population of 5 million. The Department of Diabetes, Metabolism and Endocrinology at Chiba University aims at patient-centered care in complex endocrine and metabolic disorders based on the highest standards of academic medicine. We provide the best possible treatment with common to relatively rare diseases through a team-based approach involving not only specialized physicians, but also nurses, dietitians, and pharmacists. In treating diabetes, the aim is not only to lower blood glucose, but to prevent chronic complications. Therefore, we established a Diabetes Complication Center to perform comprehensive management and prevention of complications. Diabetes Complication Center consists of doctors and nurses and pharmacists. And also we have a collaboration with cardiovascular department, ophthalmology department, neurology department. So we can evaluate all the diabetic complications. In addition, we provide nutrition education and our patients can discuss their lifestyle problems and we also provide foot care to prevent diabetic gangrene. As a regional center, endocrinologists manage pituitary disorders comprehensively in collaboration with neurosurgeons and radiologists. We see the patients of all kinds of pituitary associated disease, such as acromegaly, Cushing's disease, and hypophysitis, including not only excess of hormones, but also hypopituitarism. We are analyzing gene mutations such as AIP, GNAS, or USP8 from the tissue of pituitary gland of the patients of acromegaly or Cushing's disease to examine genotype and phenotype to clarify the pathogenesis. It is valuable to perform super-selective adrenal venous sampling in some adrenal diseases. Chiba University is one of the most experienced centers for this procedure in Japan. Super-selective AVS is very useful, especially for patients with multiple adrenal nodules in both adrenal glands. We can diagnose patients presenting bilateral APA with non-functional nodules in one side. We have also experienced Cushing syndrome in the right side and APA in the left side. By only targeting functional nodules in surgical operation, we were able to avoid bilateral adrenalectomy, resulting in complete hormonal remission. Beyond the more common disorders, we also work with rarer diseases. Werner's syndrome, also known as adult progeria, is a hereditary disease caused by the mutation in the DNA helicase. It is caused premature aging with symptoms including cataracts, diabetes, and heart disease. Japan is considered to have many more Werner syndrome patients than other countries. Our aim is to register all 2,000 estimated Werner syndrome patients through the registry and the blood, tissue, and DNA samples we aim to gather alongside it. We will eventually be able to undertake a detailed statistical analysis of Werner syndrome and understand better how it works. We are targeting diseases which are caused by a deficiency of serum protein or enzyme. We have taken adipocytes from a patient with familiar LK deficiency, we want to prove the safety and efficacy of our gene therapy in humans. We want to understand how much LK we should supply in order to correct lipid metabolism in a patient with familiar LK deficiency. Then, we want to know whether renal dysfunction and corneal opacity improve or not in continuous supplement of LK protein. Uh, PIMA is considered primarily a sporadic disease, but uh, we also recognize the presence of familial forms. However, its molecular mechanism of action remains still unknown. We have just performed exome analysis in four familial cases 
and 16 sporadic cases to identify another novel responsible genes in PIMA. Also, we revealed uh, the molecular mechanism of ARMC5 in PIMA. We are sure that those genomic information accumulated should link to more effective and appropriate diagnosis, treatment, and prevention of PIMA patients. As a regional center, a large number of patients visit our hospital, enabling us to have extensive experience as endocrinologists. Such an environment attracts many young physicians with passion from all over Japan. We like to deepen our basic research and clinical studies further to develop novel therapeutic strategies for currently untreatable disorder. We welcome patients from abroad and are willing to have international collaboration with physicians and researchers further so that Chiba University will become one of the leading facilities in the world.